enhance what you can do in Ableton Live, you can install some plugins to help you produce your music. If you're not quite sure how, here's a step-by-step -step guide to walk you through the process. Once you open Ableton Live, click on Options from the top menu. For Mac users, you'll need to click Live. Next, select Preferences. From the Preferences window, click on Plugins from the left. First, make sure that the options to Use VST2 Plugin in System folder, as well as the Use VST3 Plugin in System folder, are both turned on. Once both of those options are turned on, click on Browse for the VST2 Plugin Custom Folder option. Next, navigate to the folder where your plugins are located. Usually, Ableton can detect the plugin folder, but if not, simply select the correct folder. Once you set it up, you should see the location appear underneath. Once you're done, you can click Rescan just to make sure that Ableton has detected all of the plugins. Now you can head back to the menu and under Categories, click on Plugins. From there, you should be able to see all of the plugins that Ableton has detected on your computer. Now you can start using them to create your music. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more quick and easy tech tutorials. Also, check out these videos that you might like.